Hey beautiful biscuits, welcome back to another cleaning video. So I'm just finishing up in my living room. Um, it still needs to have all the surfaces wiped down. I was just picking stuff up and getting the vacuum going. I'm having to talk to my kids out of letting me toss the pack and play that my toddler had as a baby. And they are sad because they are using it as their playthings. I am hunting for a cleaning towel. So I maintain that one of the best cleaning tools there is are old cloth diaper inserts. You don't use anymore, obviously. Um, I cloth diapered with my first kiddo. I do not anymore because I don't hate myself enough to keep doing them. Um, they are amazingly absorbent, easy to wash. They're such good cleaning tools. I use them for dusting. Sorry, biscuits, let me raise you up. My arm was cramping up there. I use them for dusting, um, for wiping down, scrubbing, mopping, pretty much anything you can think of. Oh my goodness, my house is such a mess. Just look at this clutter here. I had to put a bunch of stuff up because the little toddler keeps, um, Herbert keeps just grabbing stuff and maiming it, so we're going with it. Okay, let me get some soap and water, easy breezy. Uh, I don't have my normal homemade vinegar spray or my multi-purpose spray right now, so I'm just gonna use soap and water. And when I have time to make my own spray, then that's what I use. Um, but soap and water works really well. All right, biscuits, we've got our little towel going. Let's see. These are dollar store socks. I highly recommend them if you want to do little crafties with your kiddos. So I don't know if you are new to my channel, but hi, I'm Rose Kelly. I am a romance novelist and burlesque artist. You can find me over on Patreon. You can find me, uh, which is Rose Kelly. You can find me over on OnlyFans, which is Rose Kelly PPV. And I am a mom of two. I am working on being a little bit more into gar I, I love gardening. I'm being, working on being more self-sustaining with my gardening. This is my hope. One day I'd like to have a homestead. Currently, I live a little bit too urban for that, but that's because I'm always working on my business and, and trying to have a time in life where I can really focus on the kiddos and gardening and relaxing and hopefully, hopefully get into that. But I wanted to say real quick, this is something we made out of those socks. They're just really cute. It's a fun little thing to do, you know, for probably a dollar, all materials in. You can make really fun crafts with kids. Um, and I homeschool my special needs uh, eight-year-old, and I also have a two-year-old um, that we do like preschool homeschool with. And crafting is so important for any kids on the spectrum, at least for mine, at least for mine, it makes such a difference. Okay, back to tidying. I'm just trying to clean off surfaces. You might ask, why is there a pot lid on my chair? Don't know, my guess, your guess. They're about equal because I have no idea. Things just appear, cutting boards. My two year old is obsessed with bringing cutting boards all over the house. They follow her around. She drags them behind herself. And if anybody takes her cutting boards, no knives or anything, just cutting board. Oh, sorry, okay, let me put this away. Okay. So one of the reasons I love homemaking is, you know, I have uh, funky lungs. I am pretty severely asthmatic. And if I don't keep my home tidy and happy, my lungs let me know about it. Now, obviously I need to do a good one on here where I actually like do some glass cleaner. This is a glass top table, but I'm really just trying to do a quick little scrub a roomy just to do some dusting because this is the time of year where pollen really starts to get everything and I'm not a fan of the pollen accumulation let me tell you tries to keep my butt oh biscuits do you want to come over this way I was gonna do the fireplace mantle here you come this way right oh, good job thanks biscuits okay oh you know what I'm gonna have to clean this more than I anticipated Okay, I'll get it done. I call this Mama's Little Helper. I love to buy the two pan chocolate bars and I snack on them. Whenever I just want a little, not even pick me up, just like a little cherry something, I have a little bite of it. And it's so yummy. Okay. Do I keep the mostly broken hair clip that I could maybe still use? Think about that. 
got this book on a fun trip. Okay, the trip itself wasn't fun, but other parts of the trip was to Germany uh, for work when I was filming travel videos. And oh, I miss traveling. I don't travel as much anymore because of COVID and life. And <laughs> I really want to get back into that though. It's such a joy. I love making content traveling. Um, you know, I've, I love, I love some of the digital nomad lifestyle, but with young kiddos, it is a little tricky too. Um, you can't really be a full-time digital nomad with kids, at least not my kids. Maybe my daughter, but not my, not my uh, kid that's on the spectrum. That would be most difficult. I don't even know who put this up here, but I'm just going to put it back. Uh, but yeah, I miss, I miss our travels. My son and I used to travel all the time for work and he got, you know, I gotta say, we stopped because it was really difficult to travel with a kid that needed so much routine and travel's disruptive for that. But I'm hoping to get back to that in a place where we can travel more slowly. Yes, that is a stocking holder. Mm -hmm. You want, I, cause I'm sure, I'm sure the biscuits of the internet will give me their opinion on it. But you know what? My daughter loves to look at that and coo and ooh and ah um, over the deer. So I just keep it out your bone. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta fix the fireplace. One of my projects is I'm hoping to DIY the fireplace mantle because all the contractors were crowing me just absolutely insane numbers for what is probably two hours of work for what I'm asking. There we go. I'm not going to dust everything down. Just what I think I can make a little leeway on. Perfection is not the name of the game for my cleaning life. It is just um, trying to be good enough to where I feel happy in my home and not at the sacrifice of spending time with family. Because so much of the time, right, the primary tidier of the house, we sacrifice all our time that we spend relax you know with family to clean and I'm not willing to do that so it does not have to be perfect Ugh. I haven't lived in a city for quite a while now until until the last year and I gotta say I'd forgotten how much like soot and stuff builds up I've been in suburbs or the country for years and you know what's terrible is I've cleaned that in the last month and that's what's accumulated um, here, let me show you. I'm cleaning the door jams and the tops and everything. Um, yeah, oof, oof, that's nasty. Those points, if you watch my romance novel streaming series on OnlyFans, um, if you know what this area stood in for um, in one of our short films. <laughs> but. Yeah, I do not appreciate the just accumulation of gunk that stuff gets. Okay. Boy, I think biscuits that I'm gonna have to like take an actual scrub brush to this door. It is just filthy. I can't believe how dirty this is. This is shocking. I'm gonna have to take a more heavy duty. Here, let me move you so that you can see it a bit better. There you go, biscuits. There. And I just see what I'm cleaning. Oh, yeah. Boy, this is really dirty. I generally don't spend too much time obsessing over doors, but I have noticed how funky and dusty these are. Um, so they are getting our spring clean scrubber rubber down. Okay. Well, not perfect, but better and hopefully better for asthma. Ooh, these are so dirty. Oh my goodness. Here, I'll show you. That is what is coming off these things. Um, which is just shocking. Oop, sorry, that's where you're gonna go. Um, let me clean this. 
Part of what's motivating me to do this is my asthma's really been acting up here. Can I show you this door here? Um, and I cleaned this about a month ago when I was doing a deep clean. And boy, they've really gotten way more dirty. Okay, biscuits, I am going to, do I want to do my windows as well? Let me see, how bad are they? They aren't too bad actually, okay. Um, woohoo! Some surfaces are wiped down. I'm really hoping that that helps my asthma because boy oh boy has it been funky lately. And hopefully, <laughs> um, just wiping some surfaces down gives it enough that my air filter that I'm gonna turn back on, um, I had to buy my little statue over there, uh, will make the air clean and will help with seasonal allergies. So if you want a little seasonal allergy tip, it's wipe down all the things you don't think you're breathing, but you are breathing that in, especially in your bedroom where you're sleeping for multiple hours a day, right? That's so important if you have any kind of allergies or asthma. Alrighty, biscuits. I'll see you in the next video. I will see you over on Instagram at the wholesome feed. Um, dots between each word, except for wholesome because that's one word. <laughs> Should I make a Hugo Homemaker one? My Instagram is self care oriented, and I'm kind of tempted to make a homemaking uh, one that is just a fun little Instagram page. We'll see. I'm trying not to overcommit myself this year because it's one of my favorite hobbies, and then getting stressed out. So I'm just trying to. Take it easy, be happy this year. I hope you are too.